if you ask me, I'm well prepared. Uh, if you ask anybody else, they may have some criticism, but I, I feel like I'm well prepared. Uh, Xavier leaving, um, I took a lot of tips from him, worked on my offensive game over the uh, quarantine, over the summer, uh, playmaking too. I'm doing a lot more of that. I have the ball in my hands a lot more. And obviously just the leadership role of just talking and just trying to gather guys, especially when it's important, especially when times are rough and their teams are going on runs, like in practice, I have to make sure I keep my own composure, let alone and let my teammates get out of hand, get emotional. So that's definitely something I'm building towards is be like this top dog leader and this top dog talker on, on and off the court. Also, as a, as a quick follow-up, I know that obviously the ankle injury took a lot from your season mm-hmm. last year and you never really got to fully put, you know, put forth a complete year. Now that you're hundred percent healthy, uh, you know, how do you feel that that will have an impact on you going into the year? Man, it's going to see a different Isaiah, man. I won't have any injuries coming into the year. I'm just trying to stay healthy the whole season. And I know how important it is for me to stay healthy and how I do not want to get unhealthy because I feel like I let my teams down, let my team down last year when I got hurt. And I know it's just because it was a freak accident injury, but it's just something I'm going to focus on every day is my treatment, my recovery. No matter what, if I'm feeling 100% or not, I'm still going to go see Alex Wong and just make sure everything's okay.